heightened awareness and concern about sports-related head injuries and concussions has elevated early assessment as a critical part of early treatment. In this scenario, a college crew team member gets struck with an oar and the team's athletic trainer is concerned about a possible concussion. Grace, what happened to you? Uh, I think I hit my head with the oar. You hit your head with the oar? Yeah. How are you feeling? Can you tell me? A little dizzy. Um, yeah. Anything else or just dizzy, you think? Dizzy, headache, my head hurts a little right okay. here. Okay. Have you ever had a concussion before or any other head injury? No. No? Okay. Um, do you know where you are right now? I'm in Norfolk, Norfolk, Virginia. Okay. Do you know what day of the week it is? It's Thursday. Okay. What did you have for breakfast this morning? I had pancakes. Pancakes, okay. Let me just uh, check some symptoms on you, okay? I'm gonna go through a checklist with you, um, and I'm gonna ask you about symptoms that you're having right now. If you don't have a symptom, I want you to give, me, give it a zero, all the way up to a, a six, which is the most severe you could possibly have. Okay. Okay, so let me run through a few of these with you real quick, okay? What's your headache level right now? Um, a two. A two. What about nausea? Um, a one. A one. Neck pain? Um, zero. Dizziness? Probably about a one. Blurred vision? Zero. Okay. Is the light bothering you at all right now? Not really. No? Okay. All right. Well, Grace, I'm a little bit worried that you might have a concussion before, but a lot of your symptoms are really mild. So what I want to do is get the doctor on the phone right now okay. and see if he can check you out too, and um, we can maybe see if we can get you back to practice. But we'll okay. let the doctor decide, okay? So let me get him on the line. Dr. Schusler, this is Grace. Um, we're out at uh, rowing practice, and she got hit in the head with an oar, and uh, I had to go through a concussion evaluation with her. We do have her parents' consent um, in order to do this um, this telehealth uh, conference with her. I was wondering if you could go through a little bit of an evaluation with her. She got hit on the back of the head with an oar, complained of mild um, uh, headache and dizziness. Uh, she has no previous history of concussion. Um, she seems to be coherent. Uh, she knows where she is, um, no loss of memory. Went through a few symptoms with her. All of her symptoms are mild. Um, she rated her headache as a two, um, nausea as a one, and dizziness as a one. All others were zeros. Patient before we contacted you. Okay, great. Hi, Grace. How are you? Hi, I'm okay. Feeling a little bit dizzy? A little bit. Okay. How was uh, so? What exactly happened to you? Um. So I during practice I caught a crab and the oar just hit me in the head. Okay. So you had a little bit of dizziness. Is that starting to feel better or is it about the same? It's starting to feel a little bit better. Okay, good. Ryan gave me all of the info about the tests that he's done so far. I want to do just a couple more and we'll see how things are going. So if you could go ahead and slide toward the screen a little bit. All right, Grace, why don't you come closer so you can talk to Dr. Schusler. Hi. All right, Grace, go ahead and uh, can you tell me what you're smelling right now? I'm smelling the water. Okay, good. You having any trouble seeing anything? Is it blurry? No, I don't have any blurred vision. Okay, go ahead and open your eyes up real big. Good. Can you look up? Yeah. And down? With just your eyes, leave your head, head straight forward. Just look with your eyes. So eyes straight up and eyes down. Look to the left, look to the right, good. All right, you're able to hear okay? I don't sound muffled or distant? No, I can hear you just fine. Okay, give me a big smile, and then stick out your tongue for me. All right, great. Go ahead and uh, put Ryan back on for me, okay? Hi, Dr. Schusler. Hey, Ryan, uh, based how everything's going, if, uh, if you think that she's good to go, uh, from my side, I think she's good to go back as well. Her symptoms seem like they've come down since her initial uh, incident, and uh, everything looks good. So if you're feeling comfortable with it, I feel pretty comfortable. She's okay to go back to practice. Okay, sounds good. Concussions are complex brain injuries that warrant a multidisciplinary treatment approach. 
Athletic trainers at sporting events conduct initial on-field assessments of sports-related injuries, including concussion. Telehealth provides early, real-time assessment and evaluation with multiple healthcare providers to ensure quick diagnosis and a proper course of action if needed. In this scenario, the physician is able to conduct a thorough cranial nerve assessment that's required for diagnosis, treatment, or clearance. In this situation, the physician can bill for this type of virtual visit. It should be noted that the assessment via telehealth was no different than it would have been in person. The provider was able to direct the athletic trainer through the assessment with easy redirection where necessary. You hear that, Grace? Yeah. So if you feel okay, you can go back to practice. You just need to make sure that if you have any symptoms come back or if anything starts to get worse, you need to make sure you speak up right away. All right. Other than that, I think we're good to go. All right, thank you.